Well, a controversial school superintendent is out of a job tonight, criticized for the way he handled a cheating scandal and guns in school. Steve Gargiola has been following the story all day long. And Steve, the decision came just a short time ago. Yeah, well, Karen, I can tell you one really good thing that was evident tonight, and that is there was no parental apathy in the Van Buren School District. Hundreds of moms and dads turned out for tonight's meeting. Number one topic on the agenda, whether or not the contract of the superintendent would be terminated. Several hundred people filled the cafeteria at Belleville High School with strong feelings about a school board motion to terminate the contract of Superintendent Michael Van Tassel. Among his critics, former teachers who spoke about a climate of intimidation from the top. The final nail in my coffin, as they say, was when my administrator, for whom I have great respect and had also left the district, told me that I needed to get out before I was forced out. He told me that I had a target on my back. I was retired, so I didn't have to worry about any retribution or intimidation. And a number of teachers called me from the high school, about a half a dozen of them, and they said, we are intimidated and he is ruining the morale in a big portion of our school district. Van Tassel, who was not at the meeting, had his supporters there, who said whether or not he did a good job, a deeply divided community needs to move forward. Mr. Van Tassel is very qualified on many levels, but just like anything, if something isn't working as well as it could, then you have to find other alternatives. The board passed the motion to terminate the contract of Van Tassel and immediately named an interim superintendent leaving some parents to again feel like they have no voice in the decisions being made in the district. They want us our input. We try to give it to them, but they seem like they shove, up, shove us off to the side. They don't want to listen to us. Well, clearly you'll never have a meeting of several hundred people and they'll all go away in agreement, except on one thing they did all agree on. They want to put the divisiveness and the controversy behind them and everybody focus on the best interest of the children in the school district and their education. Reporting live in Belleville, I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.